What's good, sports fans? I am Kendrick, the sports guy. We got a good one for you today. Make sure you like the video and subscribe to the channel. Uh, we got a bunch of money being made around here. We're talking about two massive contracts, one from the NBA, one from the NFL. Let's start with the NBA Celtics, Jalen Brown. I told you about this a couple of weeks ago that it was looking like he was going to sign the richest contract in NBA history, and that did happen on Tuesday. Brown agreed to a five-year Supermax extension worth up to $303.7 million. Again, that's the richest deal in NBA history. This would keep the two-time All-Star under contract with the Celtics through 2028, 2029 season. Brown, who is 26, became eligible for a five-year Supermax extension with the Celtics upon earning second-team All-NBA honors this past season. He averaged 26.6 points per game. He shot 49% from the field, and he will make $31.8 million next season in the final year of his previous deal. And just talk about the team's success while he's been there. The Celtics have made the playoffs in each of Brown's seven NBA seasons, uh, NBA Finals in 2022, and three Eastern Conference Finals trips. Brown was the third pick in the 2016 draft out of UC Berkeley. So again, the Celtics has locked down Jalen Brown. There's been some talk about some people saying they think he's overpaid. I've heard some some, some guys talking that he, he probably won't eventually stay a Celtic. Who knows? You never know in the world of sports. But as of today, on Wednesday, Jalen Brown has set the bar another level uh, with the richest contract in NBA history. And his teammate, Jason Tatum, may even exceed that next summer when he is uh, eligible for the Supermax deal as well. Now, let's move to the NFL where we're talking Chargers quarterback Justin Herbert. We had a lot going on on Tuesday. This happened on Tuesday as well. He became the highest paid quarterback in NFL history with signing a five-year, $262.5 million contract extension. Again, that is the uh, richest contract in uh, NFL history. Herbert threw for 4,739 yards, 25 touchdowns last season. Uh, he was uh, his third with the Chargers, and he was he's the number six pick out of Oregon in the 2020 draft. Now, in Herbert's first three seasons, he's thrown for 14,089 yards, which is the most of any quarterback any quarterback has thrown in his first. Seat three seasons in the NFL, and again, Herbert is the only player in league history to throw for 4,000 yards in each of his first three seasons. The Chargers went 10 to 7 last year, they made the playoffs for the first time since 2018, but they were bounced in the first round. So, again, we had two players getting paid on Tuesday Jalen Brown, Boston, and Justin Herbert, quarterback for the Chargers, who will now have a new offensive coordinator, Kellen Moore, the ex-Cowboys OC. Will he continue this successful trend he's on? And now what does this mean for Joe Burrow in Cincinnati? Because now the quarterback bar is probably going to get more and more richer. Uh, we already had Jalen Hurts this past summer and then Lamar Jackson. You know, they both signed those mega deals. Now Justin Herbert, he uh, overtook them. Will Joe Burrow, will he be the next one to get pizzayed? I'm sure he will. So I'd like to know what you guys think about these two contracts. Is that, that's a lot of money. Make sure you drop a comment, like the video, and subscribe to the channel. I'm Kendrick, the sports guy. We will see you on the other side and on the next report. I'm out. Peace.